What's going on, y'all? Day one. Uh, we're here, we're ready to start the day. Um, Ronzoni Elementary School, we're about to blast your entire school. You guys have no idea. We're going to take these white walls and we're going to turn them into something unbelievable, something gorgeous for you. like be kind and be um, silly and fun. The letters are going to go in the boxes, like the first half of each word, and then on the other side is going to be the letters, the other halves of the word, but in like organic. Um, I'm actually going to do like an illustration and an inspiration quote basically with a bunch of stars and just basically stay magical. Today <laughs> I'm kind of just painting whatever colors I have um, right now in my palette and making use of that and then I'll be adding an inspirational quote at the end. I really wanted to do uh, mural work and especially in the school for a long time. Um, I watched these cartoons, I'm probably going to butcher the name, but it's called Curses At and they're little science shorts uh, that have really cute chibi characters and I just kind of wanted to represent that. They're the rockets do kind of like a space game. I'm just having fun, man. Uh, I practice having fun. Um, not really exactly what I do uh, per se, but um, I just I don't know, bro. I just I like to paint and I like to I like to get out there and network and stuff. So that's all I'm doing, and hopefully the kids like it. Huh. This today uh, definitely it's a Eastern Sun inspired painting, but I always like to do some kind of wavy galactic vibes, like space vibes uh, with it. I mean, it's only uh, geometric extractionism, but you can convey a lot of emotion and feeling through uh, shape, color, and composition. Family's awesome. Declan is, believe it or not, not even our youngest artist. Um, I can't stress it enough. Just please prep walls, <laughs> and if you have a tarp, don't don't pull the tarp back because it's getting in your way. Make sure you you put the tarp in front, up to the wall instead. But no, I love it. Uh, Declan, he literally just did his first piece uh, was last weekend over at. Um, Lewis Craig, uh, he did a be positive and then he wanted to do a be kind this weekend. Um, this weekend he's going to um, change it over. He's going to do a uh, being kind is cool. He added some emojis in the cool. Uh, we're all about having the younger ones paint. Usually we tuck them away in a little bit of different nooks and crannies and such. Um, he wanted more of a forward one so we gave it to him. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, lunchtime here for Graffiti Park. Uh, we're cooking through on a Friday. We're, we're already, I think, halfway done with the project. Um, this is unbelievable. I, I think uh, more and more schools need to get on board with this because uh, there's so much output. There's so many people that want to paint. There's so many people that want to impress um, younger generations in art. Um, and uh, I think it's just a, a wonderful opportunity. So give us a shout out. Today's uh, piece, I played off of an idea that they had to remind these kids that they're awesome and I chose all the colors just because they're bright and I believe it's more positive for the kids here, especially after this year. Um, yeah. Oh, I love it. <laughs> I think it's great. love all the color that they're going to add to this uh, building. I can't wait for the kids to see it. They're going to be shocked. They're going to be really happy. <laughs> yeah, some of them are coming on Tuesday and the rest will see it when they come back in August. <laughs> You know, a lot of them are, you know, in the process, so I can't wait to see the finished product. But um, I like the word think on the staircase. I like the color scheme at the bottom of the other staircase. Um, some of those outdoor ones we've seen look really cool. So we're excited about a lot of them. <laughs> It was good. Um, wrapping up day one. Today was amazing, actually. Um, now that I'm thinking about it, today uh, today was unbelievable. Um, I'm trying to think, dude. We had 20 some odd 
probably close to 30 artists out over the course of the day. Um, we finished 80% or claimed 80% of the walls, I should say. Um, really excited for tomorrow. Uh, I get a little worried, I guess, because Saturdays are usually our busy days, and um, I don't know if we'll have a lot of a wall space for them um, to kind of tag up, so we'll see. Um, otherwise, yeah, today was uh, kind of blew all of my expectations away as what we could accomplish in a day. Day two on Saturday, uh, we've got nine kids here um, helping, volunteering over on the other end of the wall. They're gonna do like a giant scenic nature scene with kind of like a galaxy in the background. Um, over on this side, we got uh, Burner and Riot. They just started on um, something that's a, a galaxy on that side as well to finish off the Ronzoni outer space wall. Inside, uh, we're pretty much all cooped up as far as wall space. We got four spaces left. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, we're really running. Lolita's Tacos will be here in two hours. Uh, so we have chicken, beef, and we also offer uh, vegan and vegetarian options for our artists as well. Um, otherwise, y'all, this project is kicking through, no problem. I'm Declan. It's my younger brother. He's doing a second piece today um, with Graffiti Park, and uh, that's, that's about me. a wrap. Building and I saw all of this, it's just like wow, and everything such an amazing uh, painting. And just, just the murals, it just brings the whole building to a different level. It's just like, spectacular. Every time um, there's, there's some art going on in school, I always tell them, hey, well, what's the inspiration in this school? What's going on? I forget the first one was Harry Potter, the second one was Jungle, Jungle theme, and he, he was trying to say this one was space. Um, everybody's a fan of Star Wars, you know, so I had to get some Star Wars in here. Uh, the inspiration behind my piece, probably, well, I, uh, what I, the slogan or whatever was, the good old days are now, and the idea I had was that uh, I would hope kids read it and they cherish being in school, because I cherish being in school a lot, I thought it was very fun. I had a lot of fun at school and I hope that they can not get caught up in the just the madness of the internet. I appreciate the, the moment. Well, my inspiration is uh, to help inspire these kids and give them something to look at every day instead of a empty hallway. They can uh, see beautiful art down the hall now and read uh, messages and hopefully bring positivity out of them. I always like Calvin and Hobbes, that a uh, really good friendship and plus their artwork, whoever makes their artwork is really good at doing it. I mean, I, I always look into like what the school stands for and what it like, uh, like their logo and stuff and try to incorporate it into my work. So uh, this time we did a rocket since they have a, a rocket as their like logo. Well, my name is Niles, I heard about it through Instagram, started seeing the work they were doing at the schools out here, really thought it was a neat idea, so I reached out to them and see what it took to join in. Went well, this is my third mural. Um, got it done in two days, and it's the biggest one I've done so, <laughs> you know, so far. Uh, I think it came out really well. Uh, I think the school's gonna like it, and the kids will think it's, it's you know, enjoyable and trippy. Uh, a lot of kids, or a lot of people thought, uh, said it was, uh, Gave them like SpongeBob feels, so I think that'll work out well. Yeah, wrapping up day two, I guess. It's about five o'clock. We got about an hour and a half left. Um, four walls left <laughs> until we are completely uh, out of space on our biggest project ever. 
Um, this is, I guess, is more of a plea for help from all other schools that have giant walls in their back camp, or in their backyards, uh, along their back fields. Um, we love outdoor projects, may get a little hot over the course of the summer. Interior, exterior projects, not an issue. Let us paint and change your world. Yeah, uh, at Ronzoni here to do a wrap up. Um, we've got a, a nice little thank you box here full of goodies. Uh, we don't do any advertising for graffiti park services. We are all word of mouth. So um, if you like the art that we're doing, if you like anything that you see, uh, please, please, please reach out or um, uh, tell somebody about us so that we can uh, find our next project. Hi there. This is Lori McGoy from Ronzoni Elementary School and we just finished up a weekend with Graffiti Park. It was absolutely amazing. We got a lot of walls painted and the kids are loving it so much and that's what it's all about. We're all about the kids here. It makes them want to come. It makes them want to read everything and think about the positive messages we've put on the walls uh, and just enjoy all the art that's uh, been put up. So if you've even considered painting a few walls at your school, I highly encourage you to contact Graffiti Park. It was really an awesome experience. My name is Kim Fundero. I'm the assistant principal at Ronzoni Elementary School and I was not here when the painters were here. So I got to experience it Monday. I came in Monday afternoon and I was absolutely amazed at all the wonderful color on the walls and the different designs that there was out there. I mean, it goes from one extreme to another. You've got small walls, small murals, and then you've got these murals like this, this whole corner of the wall that's absolutely amazing. And that's a wrap. Another school down, 40, no, just kidding, 51 artists, tens of thousands of square feet. Thank you, Ronzoni Elementary School. You guys have been amazing for us. Is, um, we can't believe the excitement and the amount of space that we're able to cover. Uh, check us out. Our next elementary school is going to be Jacob Manch Elementary, uh, June 18th to the 20th. Um, variety of different themes on that one, um, but we all do it. Hashtag for the kids. Uh, this is Graffiti Park underscore LV. Signing off. Thanks.